This is my intro music. Welcome to the video. I hope you like it lots, so don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button. Now let's react. Hey, hi, hello there, and welcome to an episode of An Anthropologist Watches Glitter and Lasers. And we have some some of these shorts to talk about. These are not TikToks, these are the shorts. If she's posting things on her Instagram, I've, I've definitely missed them over the last few days. But y'all, y'all, we need to talk about things. So this is Glitter and Lasers, Anna O'Brien, and this is her snackle box. I'm blown away. I'm just blown away. But before we even get into the snackle box, let's let's talk about some stuff. Um, I am an anthropologist by training. I'm a retired archaeologist. Uh, I like studying the girls and girl world a lot because they're fun. And also just Anna is just it, Anna is interesting to me because I don't necessarily dislike Anna. I just think she makes like really weird decisions. And just like this character of herself that she's trying to put forward on the internet is just mind boggling because it's so not real to the point where a lot of people are starting to call her out on it, especially on YouTube, not so much on Instagram and on TikTok, but I think those two spaces are more curated than her YouTube is. So that's my guess. And she also has um two million two point some million subscribers on youtube and this has 963 likes and only has 82 comments all right so we're we're talking about anna's on this like rebranding mission she's an influencer she's a health guru she's a she's a fitness girly um so She's started kind of opening up about the things that she eats. And she did this video not too long ago about, and I think there's another snack video in here that we're also going to be looking at. But anyway, she's on a protein kick because that's the only way she's going to maintain the gains that she's getting at the gym. So this is... <laughs> so on top of the actual object that she is holding in her hand, which is some kind of organizer of some variety i'm not sure it's a food organizer it's probably something she got at the craft store because that's what it looks like it is she the brands are very important for her to be showing as well so i'm sure if i go in here i can find out exactly what box that is because i'm sure she probably has a link to it or something or it's going to pop up in a video in the future because anna also is never not selling she's always selling something if it's not the snack food she's eating it's the the containers she's using it's the clothes she's wearing it's the makeup she has on it's what else is she doing now oh she's like trying to convince us all that she does face care um and she just recently did one big haul about her exercise equipment in her home and all of the little things that she carries around afterwards to make her workouts more effective you guys because she's she is swole and she also has done a couple hauls now of all of the gym clothes that she wears and all of the shoes that she wears and i know several of you have been like i own multiple pairs of shoes okay but the difference is those of you who are telling me these things you are actually like runners and weightlifters and gym goers you are actually using these shoes so it makes sense for you to have multiple pairs just saying. Anyway, so this is part of her her uh, health influencer persona that she's trying to create. And also, we will we will talk about the the sweater once you guys get a chance to look at it. I like the the design of the sweater. I just don't like I don't like anything else about it. So let's let's learn about this snackle box. Show you guys my snackle box. These things that she's putting in here, by the way, and there's like four of them so that I can see. There's three here, and I think there's another one right here. These are like 100 calories each. You know, putting that out there. Yeah. This is cheese. This is cheese. This is cheese. This one will be cheese. There's probably 100 calories worth of cheese in each one of these little boxes. 
These are chocolate covered berries of some variety. These, those were her protein Swedish fish, by the way. And that's some kind of nut mix, which is probably going to, that serving's probably around 100 calories as well, because nuts are sneaky, sneaky bastards. All right. By the way, this says weirdo in case you haven't picked up on it. Look how. <laughs> she can't even fake being actually content or happy. This face that she's making, that's like the least, this is the very, I hate this, but I'm going to smile anyway kind of face. Like she's not happy. Just the way I like it. But trying to make fetch happen. I don't know about the grapes. I don't know about the crackers. I know the chocolate probably comes out to around 100 for a serving. She didn't measure any of this, by the way. There's no measurements for any of the loose objects. These are about an ounce each. Cheese usually comes out to about 100 calories an ounce. These I know are around 100 calories because I eat them sometimes myself. It's just, let's do some fast math. It, it's going to be dirty math. There's like 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600. And then there's four of those fuckers. So there's a thousand calories worth of snacks in this box. Okay. And there's no, I'm assuming this is multiple snacks. It's like the whole joke is it's like a tackle box, only it's her snackle box. Like a thousand calories worth of snacks in a day? This isn't her meals. This is just the snack. Health influencer. She's wearing this stupid weirdo. This the sweater says weirdo on it. And if you know anything about Anna, she's like it, she's very focused on being terminally unique. And that's what this whole weirdo sweater is about. I told myself that I would run at least once in Seattle. I have three hours until I have to leave for my flight. Do do intermission music. Do 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 intermission music. Do do. Intermission music. Do 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 do. Intermission music. One more time. Do do. Intermission music. Do 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 do. Intermission music. Do do. Intermission music. Do 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 do. Intermission music. Do do. Intermission music. Do 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 do. Intermission music. One more time. As someone pointed out in the comments section her comment section uh she had to like walk her way across here and then come back to get the camera and then cross a second time with the camera unless someone is following her which might be but i doubt it intermission music do do intermission music do 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 intermission music so here's i wanted to play this one for a reason this is her showing us her running this is her running She's, she's showing it off. A lot of people in the comments of this particular one are talking about how um, she's not running. She's just walking. She's like power walking. I'm saying that's good. Let's, if she thinks that's what running is, let's just let her keep thinking that. Because she should not be doing full out running right now. And, but the speed walking is probably really good for her. You know, it's going to get her the same cardio and it's going to be a lot less impactful on her joints which she's determined to destroy before she's 50. If she thinks that this speed shuffle is her is her run pace, let her. I'm just saying. Let's just all quit telling her that she's walking and not running and just let her think she's running. It'll save her knees. <laughs> you know? How to recover from your workouts faster. Eat more protein, both before and after. This is, uh, I think this is Greek yogurt. She's got a premier protein shake here. She's got one, two, three, four protein snack bars. These are candy bars. She's got one, two bags of, I think these are also, no. These are both chips. So she's got two bags of chips. And then she's got a bag of protein Cheez-Its from also Quest. This is her protein. This is, this is the protein she eats before and after she works out to maintain her gains. Health influencer. Do, 
do intermission music do 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 is that why every time you go running you take a nap afterwards there are a lot of videos of her she'll she'll either show us her running and then she's like immediately in bed going to sleep going to take a nap or she'll say that she's been on a run and she's currently in bed because she's going to take a nap after she went running. All right. Parfait all day. Ooh. It's giving myself a delicious snack. Oh, yes, queen. <laughs> this is her snack. This is like a 12 ounce glass with at least two servings of this Greek yogurt in it. Now I, I see that it's 17 grams of protein per serving, so cool. But also see, this is what I'm talking about with her and her advertising, her constant advertising, her constant display of her material culture. I'm pretty sure if I go and look this stuff up, I'm pretty sure these are some of probably the most expensive varieties of these that you can get, or they're like the top quality versions of these things, with the exception of, of the, of the pomegranate pips they're they are what they are but you know she's got to show this one front and center so you can see the brand name of it you know most people turn the thing so that you can't see the brand name because they're not sponsored by the brand um and then she's got this sola what is this vanilla almond granola you know it's it's front and center you know oh, i can clearly read it you know i can clearly see the the yogurt and how much uh how much grams of protein are in it i can clearly see the pomegranate pips even though we watched her do all of it and this 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 is a snack this is a at least 12 ounce glass full to near the top is a snack there's at least two servings of granola in there you know the pomegranate pips i don't care about but the the yogurt and the granola this shit adds up fast do do intermission music do 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 intermission music do do intermission music do 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 intermission music remember target remember that time in target this one time at target so the the caption for those of you playing the home game uh, when I have the hotel gym all to myself, first she comes in, I'm going to mute this by the way, maybe, there we go, first she comes in and just kind of busts in, yeah, happy-go-lucky, she does her little boogie, she goes through and touches every single weight in the room. This is a nice gym by the way, she stands here and juggles this medicine ball like a badass. And then she goes over to the weight machine and starts twerking. I'm not joking. She's literally twerking this time. I know you guys are like, no, no, she's doing this, this, that, or something else. No, she's twerking this time. This is what you do in the gym. This is how you use the equipment in the gym when no one's looking. Okay, cool. Now she's over here stealing bottles of water, like multiple bottles of water. <laughs> Doesn't even close the door correctly. I have no idea what she thinks she's doing here. I guess she thinks she's awesome. And the finale. She wipes herself off with two towels and then just throws them on the floor. Her form's actually gotten better. I'm going to give her that one. But she's in that hotel gym again. And I can tell by the equipment. Oh, okay. Her form was good. This one is just the one I wanted to talk about because of the whole... Um, target thing and just i know this is a joke this is her making fun or poking fun but it's one of those situations where it's kind of like the ashley thing when she did the hallmark movie thing for christmas she thinks she thinks she's joking like she thinks this is the joke version of herself where the rest of us are like, yeah, that's exactly how I think you act when you're in the gym by yourself, when you don't think anybody's looking. I, I do think that you are disrespectful of the equipment and that you just throw towels around and expect someone else to pick them up for you. And I don't know about the water stealing thing. I don't I don't care that much I, either. They're like dollar bottles of water. But it's just like that kind of behavior from her, that childlike behavior, childish behavior. 
in a in a space when she doesn't think she's being observed i do believe that's how she acts now she's not all by herself obviously i think I, I guess john is with her john is the name of the camera in my book i know it's a real person but whenever i see the camera filming her i'm just going to assume it's john don't care parfait all day I mean, and this, this is another one of those, those videos that she makes where she's like trying to show us how healthy she is, you know, how, how, what a health queen she is with her food and all of her like high protein food, but she doesn't talk about anything else. Like she doesn't talk about the carbs that are in this granola or the sugar that's probably in this granola. This says triple zero. So I'm guessing it has no flavor whatsoever. Um, that kind of a thing. And then this video, this is another one of those videos where she's giving advice that she has no, like, not only does she not have the authority to give the advice, she's not a trainer. She's not a, she doesn't have any fitness certifications or anything. She's just somebody who's been using um, Copilot for nine-ish months, going on 10 months at this point, and for some, and taking Wagovi, and somehow that qualifies her to be to give this kind of this level of advice you know i i personally don't like it it's there's a difference between saying this is how i recover you know but no she's saying this is how you recover not me you she has no business giving fitness and health advice she hasn't been doing it long it's like when amber gets on a diet and she loses like a quarter of a pound and she's like oh my god you guys i'm i'm this amazing diet goddess now let me tell you all about my new diet and why it's the best thing on the planet it's the same vibe anyway and then like the stuff that she shows is junk food it's just junk food all of it i don't care y'all can come for me it's junk food it's franken food junk food candy bars chips cheez it's the only healthy thing on there is the yogurt and we can even have an argument about the yogurt you know it's just one of these things just eat food eat real food like <laughs> And it's the amount of it that she eats as well. Going back to, I wanted to show you guys the snackle box here. That snack box, after she gets it filled, is roughly a thousand calories of snacks. You know, and that's not the only thing that she. That's not the only thing that she's going to eat that day. I mean, I hope not. Anna, much like Amber, kind of gives herself away sometimes, and I don't think she's intentionally doing it. I just don't think she thinks about it. Not, not like she's... I just don't think she realizes that this is what people are going to do. We've got this weirdo sweater here. This weirdo sweater is the same sweater that she's wearing in her workout recovery video. So these were at least filmed in the same day kind of a thing. And that's important when we're talking about this god-awful outfit here. This outfit that she's making, this out, this um, giant um, parfait out of, is the same video that she makes this massive salad out of. Nothing wrong with salad. All right. I may be crazy, but I'm pretty sure I'm not, which means it's been taken down. There's another video where she's making food and she's wearing this costume, costume, this outfit as well. So she's got three videos of her making large amounts of food in this outfit. One can assume that she was eating all of that in one day. So you could put together some kind of what I ate in a day if you just follow her outfits in her videos. So this one, I, I, you guys just let her think she's running. Just let her shuffle, let her power walk, tell her she's running, make everybody happy. You know, the people who are worried about her knees don't have to worry about them anymore. And the people that think she's running are going to continue to encourage her. And she's just going to ignore us anyway, because she does not interact with her audience at all. So there you have it. But th this morning this came across my feed and i watched it and i was just like 
Are you kidding me? This is your snacks for the day? One of? Because we also know that in this video, in this outfit at least, you're also showing off your chips and your candy bars and your the other thing of yogurt. So how much did you snack? And I guess this kind of does really tell us what she's eating in a day because if this is her concept of, even if she broke this up throughout the day, this is a thousand calories right here. Those candy bars and the snack chips and all that crap, those things tap out around 200 usually, somewhere between 200 and 250. Sometimes they go down to like one something. Either way, that's 100 to 200 calories per bag or bar. So there's 1,200 calories, even if she only has one. Okay. So anyway, I just wanted to talk about this stuff. And it's just, she should not be giving health advice to people. People should not be listening to her for health advice. And they should not be looking to her as some kind of fitness advisor or like fitness instructor, even tangentially, you, you know? Her journey's working for her and that's great. And it would be fine if she would just say, you know, this is my journey. But she only says that when she gets called out. Meanwhile, she's making videos like how you should recover after your workouts. Don't tell me how I should be recovering. This is how you recover. I don't do this, you know? <laughs> I know a lot of people that don't do that because it's probably not great for recovery. Hi. I was wondering when you were going to come up here. You want to say hi to everybody? I know. You don't like my lipstick. Why do you keep sniffing it? It hasn't changed since the last time you sniffed it. Now she's going to pout. All right. So if you guys have made it this far in the video, go ahead and put, I don't know, put your favorite snack emoji down in the comment section. Let me know what you guys like to snack on down in the comment section. What do you have in your snackle box? Yeah, and just let me know what you guys think. Are you, do you see improvement in her form for one? I, I, I kind of do. I'd like to see somebody else uh, go over it who, you know, does that for a living um, and just see, kind of confirm with what I'm thinking, but also, you know, what about the running pace thing? Do you guys agree with me that maybe we should just let her think she's running? Um, and just in general, just let me know what you guys think about everything that we went over. Being summoned elsewhere, apparently. By Her Majesty the Floof. And yeah. Thank you everybody who's been supporting the channel. Thank you. Stop. Thank you to everybody who's been supporting the video. The you messed me up now are you happy Blah. thank you to everybody who's been supporting the channel thank you to my subscribers thank you to my members you guys rock thank you to everybody who's going to hit the thumbs up and yeah if you've made it this far in the video you might as well subscribe i do these pretty frequently these days and yeah that's pretty much it i will see everybody in the next one bye this is my outro music you can't copyright strike me because it's just me singing this is my outro music thank you for watching see you next time